Jonathan Lee Riches investigates. I am in front of the Federal Penitentiary in Terre Haute, Indiana. Right here, Federal Correctional Complex, Terre Haute, Indiana. The Federal Bureau of Prisons Death Row Unit is here and there are almost four dozen people on death row. Matter of fact, 42 people are on death row. And I'm going to share some information about the death row unit at this facility. Check it out. Okay, this is uh, according to Wikipedia, United States Penitentiary, Terre Haute, Indiana. It's a high security United States federal prison for male inmates. It is part of the Federal Correctional Complex and is operated by the Federal Bureau of Prisons, a division of the United States Department of Justice. USB Terre Haute houses a special confinement unit for male federal inmates who have been sentenced to death, as well as the Federal Execution Chamber. Most inmates sentenced to death by the United States federal government, government are housed in USP Terre Haute prior to execution, with few exceptions. Let's scroll down. You see it right here. It, it is at the western corner of Indiana. Death Row. On July 19th, 1993, the federal government designated USP Terre Haute as the site where federal death sentences could be carried out, including the establishment of the Special Confinement Unit, the Federal Death Row for Men. The F Borough of Prisons modified USP Terre Haute in 1995 and 1996 so it could house death row functions. On July 13, 1999, the Special Confinement Unit, unit at USP Terre Haute opened and the BOP transferred male federal death row inmates from other federal prisons and from state prisons to USP Terre Haute. There are currently 44 men on federal death row. The vast majority of these are housed at USP Terre Haute. The federal government chose Terre Haute as a location of the men's death row due to its central location within the United States. Since 1963, 16 people have been executed by the federal government. All 16 were executed at Terre Haute. Timothy McVeigh was convicted for his responsibility for the Oklahoma City bombing, was the first prisoner executed by the federal government since the National uh, Memorandum Memorandum on the Death Penalty was lifted in 1976. And the U.S. federal death penalty was reinstated in November 1988. The method of execution used by the federal government is lethal injection. So there you go. There's a, almost four dozen people on death row in Terre Haute, Indiana. So yeah, and the Trump administration executed 13 people at the end of 2020, in the summer of 2020, through when Trump left office. 13 people, the most in U.S. history. Trump was just signing them off and giving them their death warrants and uh, they were being executed. But at this facility here, Terre Haute, Indiana, what's your thoughts on the death penalty? Some famous people here, you, uh, Dylan Roof. Dylan Roof. Dylan Roof is here. And Timothy McVeigh got executed at this facility here. I'm at the front gate we can go up so much and then it says no trespassing here it is subscribe to my channel like hit the notification button let me know what you think i am out at the scene Terre Haute, indiana we will talk soon stay tuned